Hey, hey, everybody. This is Larry. This is day two of the the Code Daily Challenge. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's farm. Uh, today, I am in Saguda, here in Lavada, Latvia. My, it's really cold. My mouth is like frozen and I haven't been using it. Uh, yeah, here's a bridge behind me with a lot of Latvian flags. And yeah, um, yeah, I just checked out a couple of castles and now it's time to check out some of those problems. Something about maybe your castle is in another princess. That's not quite right, is it? Anyway, all right. Yeah, uh, I'm back at the Airbnb. I uh, hope you enjoyed that uh, castle. Uh, well, I guess I didn't go to it. I, I went to castle, but you didn't see it. But yeah, uh, let's take a look at today's day two. Uh, I'm still in Latvia uh, having fun. And today we have 838 push dominoes. Okay. There are end dominoes in line. We place domino vertically. Okay. We push some of the dom dominoes to the left or to the right. After each second, each domino that is falling to the left pushes and adjacent to the left. Similarly, to the right, it goes to the right. Okay. When a vertical ha uh, domino has a domino falling from both sides, it states vertical. Okay, for the left, of, for the purpose of this problem, expect no additional force. Uh, expand. Okay. So L is. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, what does this mean? Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay. So that means that. Da -da 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 -da, right? So here, okay, uh, okay, they, they didn't draw it, and then this one, uh, okay, uh, yeah, okay, so the first thing to notice is that n is 10 to the fifth, so you can't do an n square type thing, so you have to be a little bit smarter, right? Let me sit up a little bit more, even if I'm in the bed, uh, right, and then what's next? Uh, I think it's just, for each one, we want to propagate, uh, I think mean, it's just simulation, right? Because basically for each one, you push and you push until you can't push anymore, right? But as a result of that, then, uh, huh, actually, maybe that's not quite right. Because basically, if you have, I'm looking at this one, uh, yeah. Yeah, I and mean, I think for each domino, then we have two things, right? One is, what is the, the uh, how far away like, if you want to say, and I don't know if this is quite right. Oh, yeah, this is actually what I, I mean. I didn't actually read it correctly, but uh, after each second, one one domino gets pushed. So then it's almost like a, similar to a shortest path thing, right? Like, for example, looking at example two, you know, this one is two from one of the R's or two seconds from uh, a force from the right, from its left side going to the right and opposite as well, right? So here we can just pre process each left and right for, for, as a result, as like a shortest path thing. And then, <coughs> excuse me, I know Jesus. I don't know why, it's, I don't know if, if something is in, in this room or something, because I feel like when I was walking up and about, and even before I'm talking, I was okay. Well, maybe that's just because I'm not talking. But in any case, as I said yesterday, like my nose is. Like, when I, I can't talk and breathe easily at the same time because my nose is very congested. Which is not great when you're doing a, you know, a video where all you do is talking. But, so my apologies, my, uh, you know, hope you're, uh, 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 hope you're breathing better than I am anyway. But in any case, so yeah, uh, yeah, it becomes a we, uh, sort of a shortest path of like, okay, what's the, what's, how many seconds until it gets a push from the left and how many seconds until it gets a push from the right and then you kind of just do that, right? So here we can have like maybe not, uh, 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 right? Uh, we can say what? Uh, experiencing a force from the left experiencing a force from the right, right? And maybe we, ha we can have infinity just as a default value, right? So then, uh, from the left, the first one is going to be infinity, because well, there isn't one, but yeah, or well, maybe even just like current is you go to uh, okay, I'll write it in a bit better way, right? 
So yeah, so then now we go for i in range of n, where n is the number of dominoes, right? Uh, actually, you can even write like d for direction or something for for in for in dominoes. And then now, if d is equal to r specifically, that means that it is going to push to the right. That means that future ones have, you know, uh, an experience to the left. So current reset infinity. If this is the case, then current is equal to zero, right? Uh, else, else, we increment by one, and that's basically it. And then, uh, and then now, left we append current, and that's it. Yeah. For the left side, right? And then we do the same for the right side. Uh, except for now, we want... Uh, let's just go backwards, right? Uh, and then if D is equal to left, same thing, same idea. You probably could uh, simplify this, but it's fine, right? And then now, uh, we want to reverse right, because we've well, been going from right to left, right? And then now, we just match them up. So, uh, answer is equal to do, right? So, for i in range sub n, uh, 2n, if uh, I think it, the way that I did it is a little bit awkward because of the infinity uh, situation. Uh, we can probably handle it a little bit better. Uh, let's just say current is equal to min current infinity. So, if it goes over infinity, then you know it's. It's a lazy hack, but in any case, uh, yeah. Uh, then now, if left is equal to right, then we print, or oh, not print, sorry, we append uh, a period because then, then yeah, there's no, f or ye either, there's no force on either side, and they're both infinity, or they're equals force, right? So that's that, and then else, if left is greater than right, that means that left is further away from the right side, so then that means that right will push it to the left and then it just pushes to the left else then there's only one more condition right so we just do it to the right i think this should be okay hopefully this should be okay and i'm wrong oh well i mean this is wrong anyway but uh but i i think i have to do uh, i have to convert it to uh, a string but that part's not that bad but it's still wrong but uh am i just really wrong why am i so wrong <laughs> Uh, let's see, let's print left and right, print left, print right, 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 zero, zero, okay, uh, one, zero, if left is equal to, but right is bigger than left in this case, so why is it doing R? Oh, what am I doing, what is left and right? I mean, left and right are the arrays. Wow, I am an episode. Uh, I mean, left sub i. <laughs> Whoops. All right, hopefully now this is right. Uh, okay. Okay, it's beyond a silly mistake. But Okay, so first one, just want to check that one first. Uh, but this one, not so much. Why? So L, 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 R, R. That's this one. Right. Uh, why is that? The infinity is uh, not useful, actually. Uh, oh, I see. The reason why my my thing is wrong, and I uh, whoops, is that um. Uh, on from the third domino, well, there's no force on left or right, but but this right angle, uh, but this pointing to the right, uh, thinks that because this should be, uh, how do I say it? This uh 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 this left sorry this left pushes to the left and it gets incremented. Um, so that it gets here it's at five. So I cannot do them independently, even though I I mean I did do it. But that that's wrong, um, because the force cannot go through other forces, right? So that's basically the reason why this is wrong. Um, hmm, how do I handle that? Wow.
for some reason I thought that that could be good enough. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I think the f short answer is we probably just have to handle it, which is that if there's if we see a right, then we just set it back to infinity, because that means that if there's a, a left past that, it won't get to this point anyway. So I think maybe we can do that. I think that's fine. I just w w uh, had to think about it in my head. I thought that I didn't need to handle it, but clearly I am wrong. Right, so something like that, and then similar for uh, this. Okay. Looks okay. Give it a submit. And in fact, we're better than okay. We are good. Uh, a little bit on the slower side, but that's fine. But yeah, uh, I mean, everything is linear, so that is it. Um, it's a little bit tricky, a little bit ad hoc, a little bit simulation -y. I mean, the key thing is just knowing that you can do n square. I think the other parts, uh, as long as you don't do n square and you're able to kind of fix it in a good way, you're okay. Uh, that said, it's easier said than done, so who knows. But uh, yeah. Uh, that's all I have for this one. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. And yeah, let me show the top, show the bottom a little bit. And that's it. Stay good, stay healthy, take a mental health. I'll see y'all later and take care. Bye-bye.